2020 Chevrolet Corvette 1LT Base Interior Review, Bare Bones Done Right. What it's like to sit inside the base model Corvette. When we crowned the new C8 Corvette our 2020 car of the year, it was after we'd tested a fully loaded car with all the goodies. Would our impressions have changed had a base Corvette been part of the evaluations? After all, the C8S base price of $59,995 is pretty amazing, so Chevy had to have cut corners somewhere, right? We finally got our hands on a base Corvette, officially known as the 1LT trim. The mid-level trim is the 2LT, and the fancy 3LT, which is the most ordered trim level for the 2020 Corvette thus far followed by 2LT and 1LT, tops out the range. We covered the performance numbers in our first test, so the focus here will be on the interior. One thing that stood out during our figure 8 testing were the standard seats. Despite the lack of side bolster adjustments, the standard seats provide a good amount of lateral leg and torso support. The leather feels good, as well, and appears to be fairly durable. The steering wheel is also leather-wrapped and power-adjustable. Perhaps the only downside here is the lack of memory settings. When it comes to interior color choices, the Base 1 LT is limited to three combinations all black, black, and gray, or the black and red combo that our test car had. Red is found primarily on the seats, but the red contrast stitching on the door panels and dashboard do a great job of tying everything together for a premium look. Interior brightwork consists of brushed aluminum that's tastefully done and helps break up the black dashboard. Like the more expensive 2LT and 3LT trims, the 1LT also gets two digital screens for the instrument panel and infotainment system. We've usually had good experiences with General Motors touch screens, and our experience with the C8 Corvette is no different. It's touch screen fairly intuitive and sharp looking. The instrument panel has multiple configurations and menus that take some time to get used to, but overall, both screens befit a premium sports car. Other standard tech items include Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, now wireless for the 2021 model year, an available Wi-Fi hotspot, and dual-zone climate control. The Corvette 1 LT is fitted with a 10-speaker Bose sound system that sounds fantastic. It's hard to imagine how much better the premium 14-speaker Bose setup in the 2LT and 3LT is. After our extended time with the 1LT Corvette, we're having a difficult time calling it a base car because it looks and feels like a premium product worth far more than its sticker price. The iconic sports car has been reinvented. After decades of waiting, the Corvette switches from its traditional front-engine layout to a mid-engine platform taking its performance capabilities even higher. That change results in a Corvette that looks more aggressive than ever. The cabin is nicely appointed and extremely driver-oriented, remedying past Corvette's interior qualms. It retains Corvette hallmarks like a removable roof panel and actual, usable cargo capacity. A powerful V8 engine is mounted between the cabin and the rear axle, optimizing weight distribution and dynamic potential. Power is channeled through a dual-clutch transmission, a Corvette first but a manual transmission is not yet unavailable. We like the C8 Corvette Stingray. We like it a lot. So much, in fact, that we named it our 2020 car of the year. We counted its blistering performance when making that decision, but there's so much more to the 2020 Corvette. It's an engineering masterpiece with wild looks, good efficiency, and a comfortable ride. But performance is really what the Corvette is all about. Its acceleration, braking, and handling are on the level of true exotic supercars. That it performs the way it does, at the price it costs, is an incredible achievement by Chevrolet's engineers and accountants. Still, it's not perfect. The styling, while undeniably sporty and eye-catching, is quite busy and a bit oddly proportioned from some vantage points. In its street setup, it has a tendency to understeer when driven hard. The brakes don't have a particularly reassuring feel at the limit. These are easy to forgive, though, considering the 2020 Corvette's overall appeal. The way it looks, the way it sounds, the way it makes you feel, are better than any Corvette before it and many other storied performance cars. In short, 
the C8 Corvette is fantastic, and will never pass up an opportunity to get behind the wheel.